Marcus Scott, you're reporting on the cathedral, the Notre Dame Cathedral fire. Fire, fire in Paris. Who done it? Who done it? The conspiracy theories are flying, right? Is it a conspiracy theory or are we trying to, are we crowdsourcing the investigation into who set the fire in Notre Dame, right? So I got it down to, we have four choices now. Four choices. Blah, 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 blah. Right here to the four choices, right? One is, number one, Jewish lightning. <laughs> Jewish lightning. You never heard of the phrase? You think I made it up? No. Jewish lightning, an insurance job, right? That's the, that's the rumor floating around. Jewish right, uh, lightning, right? The second one is Muslim terror. Muslim terrorist is a guy running across the roof. Uh, like a cathedral burning the place. He's got a towel on his head. Let's take a look at that one. Um, yellow vest revenge. Yellow vest. I'm a yellow vest guy. Right? I got my yellow vest guy right here. I see my fucking yellow vest guy. So... I support Yellow Vest, but did did somebody get angry? Did somebody get kicked in the balls at one of these uh, at one of these rallies and decide to go burn down the cathedral? I don't know. It is a possibility. And the other one is a total accident. Oops, we burned down the the eight hundred year old cathedral. Oops, sorry. Is that a possibility too? I mean, it is a possibility, but it's an outside possibility. So let's uh, let's let's just look. Let's just revisit the horror. Our Lady Notre Dame, the treasure <sighs> of Paris. Horror. Is in- the horror of the flames. Damn. Right, let's listen a little bit. Hours before it was declared extinguished, nearly 400 firefighters battled the flames that altered the city's skyline. The blaze collapsed the cathedral spire and spread to one of its rectangular towers as throngs of spectators watched in stunned horror from nearby buildings, bridges, and streets. So why did Notre Dame burn so fast? Well, okay. So here's these. This is good statistics. I just found this right. So it, they're going to tell you what the cathedral is made of. It's made of wood, oak. Listen, check this out. Well, its medieval roof framework consisted predominantly of huge pieces of timber. The supports were made up of large pieces of wood and were built from an estimated 13,000 oak trees. The original parts of the frame would have been made from trees that first sprouted in the eighth or ninth century. Think. All the way back before Napoleon, Marie Antoinette, Louis XIV, and Joan of Arc. All the way to the Vikings, Charlemagne, and the decline of the Mayan civilization. Gunpowder had only just been invented when these oak trees came to life. Over the years, as the church fell into disrepair, crumbling stone was replaced with even more wood, increasing the fire risk. Notre Dame's website even warned that fire is not impossible. As Notre Dame burned, the outpouring of grief around the world reflected the church's sweeping place in history. One of Europe's most iconic structures. You see that yellow smoke pouring out of the top too, right? Oak, oak wood, right? 800 year old wood burns like it's like flash paper, right? So, so that is a possibility, right? So uh, a a distinct, we now know that the thing is wood. Was it an accident? Let's check it out. So, thank you, Lucy in the sky. Lucy in the sky with diamonds. Lucy in the sky with diamonds. I hear John Lennon singing in the background. Uh, so, Lucy is our, um, is our French correspondent. Uh, Marcus Conti reporting our French... Correspondent, thank you, Lucy in the Sky, Boots on the Ground in France, says, The following statement is from Benjamin Moten, former, this is, this is accident, ruling out accident. And then we're going to look at the other, the other four, the other three, terrorism, yellow vest, Jewish lightning. Right? Former chief architect of historical buildings uh, who uh, was in charge of, of the cathedral until 2013 and also in charge of fire detection, quote, right? In my experience, in my 40 years experience, I have never known such a blaze. Quote, when I was in charge of fire detection, which was a very expensive mechanism, very few minutes were necessary for an agent to be sent for checking. We had many wooden doors replaced by fire doors. All electric appliances were forbidden in the attic roof spaces. And that's where the fire broke out. Quote, the fire cannot have started from a short circuit from a simple one-off incident. A real fire, a real fire load is needed to initiate such damage. And, and as well, he says, oak is a very res, uh, resistant wood. 
Well, I don't know about that. 800-year-old wood burns, no matter what it is. Right? So his, so Lucy in the Sky, and anybody who speaks French, kindly translate this. This type of wood doesn't burn like that. Ah, no. You know, the chêne that has 800 years old, it's very hard. Essayé d'en faire brûler. Enfin, moi, j'ai jamais essayé. Mais du chêne, du vieux chêne, c'est pas évident du tout. Il faut mettre beaucoup de petits bois pour y arriver. Là, je sais pas s'il y en avait. So that's the guy, right? Right? Is that the guy? That's that's who uh, that's who this guy is, right? So the guy who just said that, that was him. His name is Benjamin Morton. That's who he says. So the accident, right? Accident is, it's an outside possibility, right? And why did why did Macron and and all of the uh, the big wigs in France come right out and say, "Oh, it's a fucking accident, fucking accident, accident." All right, so accident is is D is D on our list. Let's look at A. Jewish lightning. It's not a knock on Jews. I didn't make it up. You think I made up Jewish lightning? You think I'm making it up? Did I make up Jewish lightning? Did I say? Did Conti say fucking Jewish lightning goofing on Jews? No, Jewish lightning. To set your house or business on fire, on purpose, to get the insurance money. Hey, what happened to the bar? The owner wasn't doing so well, so he got struck by Jewish lightning. <laughs> yeah, fucking true. Suppo supposed cause of fire deliberately arranged by the owner to burn down a property or business in order to benefit from insurance money or similar such destruction. Ah, Jewish lightning! Was it Jewish Lightning? No. Let's find out. Notre Dame has no insurance. Damn, fucking no insurance. This shit burned to the ground. No insurance. How do you not have insurance on fucking how many billions of dollars worth of stuff, right? After Notre Dame disastrous fire Monday, one big question was what sort of insurance policy could possibly be a backstop to, to help rebuild an 856-year-old world landmark filled with valuable rarities? The answer is none. Oh, God damn it. God damn it. It's like a Jewish, yeah, Jewish lightning is getting ruled out here. Or is it? Let's find out. The vaulted cathedral has no, the vaunted, excuse me, has no uh, insurance, a spokesperson for the French cons consulate in New York City told Market Watch. Uh, France owns Notre Dame, just like it owns all religious buildings erected before 1905, he said. The French state is self-insured by Notre Dame. It has no insurance. It is supposed to cover its own costs. He, uh, he noted the French state is uh, charged with maintenance and renovation of these buildings, which it lends to the church for free. While, church, while France may be technically on the hook, it's, it's hardly the case that uh, the country will have to drum up funds alone. French banks and billionaires have pledged massive sums for the rebuilding effort online. Hundreds of GoFundMe campaigns have been sprouting up raising money. Uh, as of Tuesday, $790 million has been pledged, the Wall Street Journal reported. The repair costs have been estimated to be somewhere in the range of $8 billion. Holy shit. Ten years, right? So, 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 um, so, you know, hey, look, billionaires love this shit, man. Billionaires, I can get my name on a fucking, oh, it's going to be the, uh, the Bill Gates Tower or the Warren Buffett Hallway or the, or the, uh, you know, billionaires, uh, you know, uh, fucking Jeff Bezos conference room inside of the church. Billionaires love this shit. They line up to to do it. So I, I don't know. I mean, it's still an outside shot. Is it, is it do, do billionaires burn down a cathedral to, so that they can get their name on the rebuild? That's unlikely. But nonetheless, there is no insurance and... Uh, it could, so that's Jewish lightning as a possibility. It's an outside possibility. The other one that we've already talked about, I did a full video on this, about uh, countless churches throughout Western Europe are being vandalized, defecated on a torch. Now, fuck you if you're saying that I'm a Muslim hater, because that's not what I'm doing. Right? This is not to, to, to discuss what might have happened in a, in a massive landmark in France, burns to the ground with fucking flames and smoke shooting out the top. Right? It's not oh it's 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 okay to to flush out what might have happened. So fuck you about the Muslim hating shit. All right. Talking about the facts. 
In France, two churches are uh, desecrated every day on average, right? I already read these statistics. I did the video. It's down. Fucking find it. Uh, 878 attacks were registered uh, in one year. Right, so here's, here's some, some asshole spreading his asshole on the wall, making a cross, right? So am I making it up? No, I'm not making it up. Right, so, so smearing human ex excrement, twisting fucking Jesus, excuse me, twisting Jesus' arms and, and, and mangling religious stuff inside of a church is, 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 is a, a smack in the face to all the Catholics and all the people that believe in that stuff, right? So is it a possibility that des desecrating the Virgin Mary, all those things. Crosses are broken, altars smashed, Bible set on fire, right? Guy screaming Ali Akbar on the way out the door. Ali Akbar! Ali Akbar! Right. So, <laughs> so uh, hardly anyone writes and speaks about the increased attacks on Christian symbols. There is an eloquent silence in both France and Germany about the scandal of the desecration and origin of the perpetrators. Not a word, not even the slightest hint that this could be uh, anywhere led to the suspicious migrants, right? If you speak up, you're accused of hatred, hate speech, and racism. Ah, we know all about that. In, her, in virtually every instance of the church attacks, authorities and media obfuscate the identity of the vandals. In, in those rare instances when the Muslim or the migrant ident identity of the destroyer is leaked, the perpetrators are then presented as suffering from mental illness. Ah. So that is a distinct possibility. Now there's this, right? There's the, here's the, uh, the Muslim running across the roof. I had video, I don't know what it is. Right? Ah, he's got a he's got a fucking he's got one of the Muslim things on his head, man. He's got a fucking towel around him. What's the Muslim doing in the church? What's the Muslim doing in the you can hear the Muslim words in the background? What's the Muslim doing in the church? Is he a painter? What a what a Oh, he looks like that's Osama. That's Osama bin Laden. Running on the roof of the church, burning the fucker down. God damn. Mm. Ah, right, so that's that one too. Right? Is it real? I don't know what it is. I, honestly, I don't know what this video is. It is circulating around. Is it true? They're saying you do seem to see fire over here. Is that at the point where the fire breaks out? Somebody's still in the building running around. The fire breaks out in the attic part of the thing. I, I don't know. Whatever. But uh, all right. So so the that's uh, so that's uh, uh, Muslim terror, Jewish lightning, Muslim terror. And what about the yellow vest, right? We're not going to give you guys a break. You know what I mean? Come on, man. This shit is crazy, right? Cops busting heads, man. Breaking heads in Paris, man. You don't think somebody got pissed off? You might have pissed off the wrong yellow vest. The guy wearing a yellow vest ready to shoot. You ready to shoot me in the face? Fucking guy's getting blown. Look at this shit. It's like a war zone, man. You don't think this is pissing people off? You don't think people are pissed off? You're banging around people, right? Somebody, you, you piss off the wrong guy and they come back and they burn your church to the ground? That right? is it possible? I mean, that was my first impression. Push back on oligarchy, right? You know, there's the saying, you know, like you either, you either let the new people in to society or they will burn it to the ground. Right? Let, let the new generation in or they will burn the motherfucker to the ground. Right? And you got a fire, right? You got the you got the vintage vintage wood burning smoke. They smoked your oak. Smoking oak in the middle of the in the middle of the city. Is it yellow vest? Did you guys do it? No claims so far. Nobody's claiming anything. Someone said, Oh, the Muslims when they do something, they 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 stand up and say we did it. Well, there's no evidence of that because in this case, because a thousand churches were already desecrated and nobody claims it. Right? All they say is Ali Akbar on the way out the door, right? So is it yellow vest? There's some pissed off yellow vest. Right? Pissed look at these cops. Look at this. This is like this is these are these are your fellow citizens. Fellow citizens beating people up because they're standing where they're not supposed to. Right? Was it a young thug went in there and said, Oh yeah, you're gonna kick my ass? I'm gonna I'm gonna burn your goddamn 
religious shit to the ground, motherfucker. So it is possible, right? So, so Marcus Cotty reporting on the the possibilities, the very distinct possibilities. What's your opinion? Was it Jewish lightning? Put A. Was it Muslim terror? Put B. Was it yellow vest uh, revenge? Is C. And D. Total accident. Total total mess up. I don't know. Where do I stand right now? I don't. I don't think it's. I don't think it's D. Right? Based on just, I I can't. It, 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 it's impossible to believe that some stupid guy, you know, accidentally left his you know left his jigsaw on or some other electronic device that blew up into flames and burned down the attic. I I just I don't believe that. I, I don't I. I'm not buying it. So did some? Is there an accelerant? Why did? Why is the French government coming out so quickly saying, "Oh, this was an accident," and seven hundred billion, you know, seven hundred million dollars rolls in, at, you know, oh, sh- uh, we'll take the seven hundred million and we'll just rebuild, right? Because if it's if it's a terror attack, I don't know. What, whatever. I'm just speculating. I don't know. What is your opinion? You've given my opinion. What do I think? A, B, C, or D? Uh, I don't know. I think uh, A, B, or C. Uh, Marcus Conti reporting. 